Hello beautiful soul, I'm back to bring you guidance from the angels for this beautiful week just coming up, the week of the 2nd of July through the 8th of July 2018. So if this is your first time here, remember to go to the subscribe button below and click on the bell right next to it so you'll be notified whenever I post a new guidance or a new Reiki healing here in my channel. And also if this is your first time here, I want to welcome you to my channel, to our beautiful souls family. My name is Maria and I'm very grateful to have you here with me. So today we're doing angel guidance and we are going to use the Ar Archangel Oracle cards. This is by Doreen Virtue. This deck has 45 cards. It's a beautiful deck. Each card comes from a different Archangel. So let's see who is going to connect with us for this beautiful week. And for now, I ask you to close your eyes, take a deep breath in, connect with me, connect with the angels. Let's invite their energy to come close to us, to come to the cards, pick up the right cards for this beautiful week. So the message is gonna resonate with all of us, it's gonna bring us a little, bit, a little bit of clarity, a little bit of light for this beautiful week. So let's choose, let's get a card for Monday and Tuesday first. And here we go. As always, if you haven't watched my guidance yet, the cards are always flying. So I got two cards for today, and we have sensitivity coming from Haniel, which says, you are extra sensitive to energies and emotions right now. Honor yourself and your feelings. So my dear, what Haniel is talking about for the beginning of the week, is that it is important for you to honor how you feel, to honor who you are, to be truth to yourself, to be truth to your truth. <laughs> they wanted to, they, honey, I want you to understand that it's important right now to simply raise, to simply come out of the shadows, enough of pretending to be who you are not, enough of just hiding your feelings. This is the proper time to raise. This is the proper time to honor, finally honor how you feel. It is really important to be who you truly are. It doesn't matter what other people will say. What matters is that you are in alignment with your truth. You are in alignment to the way, with the way you feel about yourself, the way you feel about people, the way you feel about your life. So honor whatever you feel. Honor the things you want to achieve. This is your life. These are your dreams. No one else is living it for you. So it's important to honor yourself. It's important to give enough attention, give enough value to who you are. So remember this, my dear. If you don't actually understand how important you are, how beautiful you are the way you are, how beautiful are the things you feel, no one else will understand. So honor your feelings, be truth to yourself, okay? And also we have Archangel Michael beginning the week with us. <laughs> and he's also talking about this. The card says, remember who you are. And he's saying, you are a powerful, loving and creative child of God. You are very loved. So my dear, understand all oh, Sorkin Angel Michael is just coming right after Haniel to reinforce the message, to let you know that you are beautiful the way you are. You are so much loved by them because your heart is who you are. The love that lives within you, this is your truth. So understand this, understand how powerful you are, how wonderful you are by being who you are. You are unique. There's no one else like you in this entire planet. How wonderful is that? It's a blessing to be who we are because as individuals, we, we bring something beautiful to this world and as a collective consciousness, we all connect to each other and we all raise and bring even more to each other. 
So remember, my dear, both of these archangels are reminding you today that you are wonderful, you are a being of light, you are a being of love. Be truth to this. Honor this love that you are. Honor the feelings you have. Honor who you are. Your truth is what matters. And this is what they want you to understand. Okay, let's move on. Let's, let's get the cards for Wednesday and Thursday now. Again, asking the angels to pick up the right card. And let's, let's see who is going to come forward now for the middle of the week. I'll continue to shuffle until the right card comes out, until they tell me which card to pull. So let's breathe and continue to ask them. Sometimes it takes, and it's here. It takes some time, but it is here. And we got Raziel saying spiritual understanding. And Raziel says, I am bringing you esoteric information and symbols and helping you understand the spiritual truth. So Haniel is working very close actually to all with all of us to the entire planet to raise all of our vibration, to bring our consciousness into a deeper awareness. And this is what he's doing with you also. He's the one working with you right now to help you grow spiritually, to help you understand things that are not yet clear, to help you understand spiritual truths, to bring you answers. So work with Raziel during this time right now to bring you the answers, to bring you the things you need to understand, to bring you in connection with the people that are going to answer your questions, that are going to clarify information for you. So it's going to resonate with your heart. So it's going to bring you the right understanding about yourself, about the universe, about any kind of spiritual understanding that you're seeking right now. So work with Razio. Like I told you, he's working with all of us as an entire uh, community, as an entire uh, collective consciousness. He is also bringing answers to all of us. He's bringing our vibrations higher and individually. So this is why he's stepping forward to remind you to work with him, to remind you to invite him to your life right now so you will understand things clearly. Okay, let's move on for the weekend. Shuffling again, breathing, inviting their love, their beautiful light, and the card is here. And we have Shamuel. I love working with Shamuel. The card is peace. And he says, peace comes from remembering that only love is real. So my dear, remember also, the angels are talking so much lately about the power of love the power of this energy love is the highest vibration of all love is what heals love is what transforms so remember to always return to love in any situation return by being present in love by being more compassionate by being more understanding by being in alignment with the divine through love through your heart this is going to bring you peace this is going to bring you again understanding even spiritual understanding will come from the energy of love so use your weekend to connect with this love energy that lives within you to sit down in meditation to simply breathe in light to your heart invite the love energy to take over to raise your vibration to keep you calm and connected with you with your angels to recharge you invite this beautiful energy to even heal you to go wherever you need to be healed wherever you need to be transformed this energy is so powerful and it's, there is showers and showers of divine love coming to all of us constantly. But there are still many people that are not uh, being open for it. So today I invite you to be open, to be willing to receive, to surrender to the love of the divine, 
to take over, to shower you, to recharge you, to bring you to who you are, to bring you back to who you are. Because again, like Samuel is saying, only love is real, nothing else. So remember this, my dear, okay? So this was our guidance for the sweet week of the 2nd of July through the 8th of July. I want to thank you so much for being here with me, for being part of this tribe of beautiful souls, for being in connection with me, with my heart, with all of us. We are all connected as one. So thank you for being here. If you know someone that will uh, be benefiting from these messages from the angels, remember to share the video with them so we bring more lights to this world together. And also, if you would like to book a private uh, guidance with me, I will be more than happy to do it for you. I will leave uh, my email in the description. You can mail me for more information or you can also go to my website. And remember also to go to my Instagram, my Facebook and Twitter. I post daily guidance there to bring you love and light to your lives, okay? Thank you for being here. I will talk to you soon again and I wish you a wonderful, a blessed week in the company of your angels. Remember to honor who you are. Remember to understand your spirituality through your heart, through your love. Okay? I'll see you again soon. Namaste.